what's going on this is legend number all about the kicks subscribe to that channel put a like on that button but i want to talk about meat mills meat mills he he he, he bug it man people trying to cancel him man um meat mills to get his solo career back together man only person i could think that could make him sell a lot of albums is he got to do us do a couple songs with drake now i know drake came out what 907 but then his, his album didn't come out to 2010 but Meek Mill's album came out 2011 and he kind of like Drake kind of like you know put Meek Mill's on the map like putting them on the map like people might say they might not agree with me but that's what I think um first album Drake did with uh Meek Mill's is Church Fire Song Double Platinum um it's Fire Song um that first album Meek Mills went double platinum. Then he came up with the second album, the song Rico. That song blew up. That song platinum. The singles platinum. The album's platinum. Um, every every album that Drake was on, Meek Mills saw a lot of albums. You know what I'm saying? Drake was on uh, on his other album. I think it was his, it was his fourth album. That was like kind of like Meek Mills comeback album. His third album was good too, but people was like, oh, the first two was better. Um, his fourth album, I think it was called Cheers. Or something like that. That album was fire. Drake was on that joint. Double platinum again. And then, you know, Meek Mills came out with another album that was the last album on Land of Records. Drake wasn't on that album. Um, he had a lot of a lot of features and it was it was it was, it was a good it was a good album, but it didn't sell. Um He need to get with Drake. Meek Mills need to just, you know, he needs to. You got a lot of people is this you don't want to ruin your career over some stupid stuff man. and meek mills just need to go in the booth we talk about this all the time you just need to go in the studio put another album out and shut everybody out meek mills is one of the dopest rappers in the game I, I, you, you gotta the, with all the stuff he do the, all the petty stuff he do he's one of the dopest rappers in the game and i feel like you need to get with drake do a collab if you do a collab album with drake <laughs> that's that's going three times flat it, it's just going out of out of here you know what i'm saying you see that 21 savage album that's triple platinum so it is a miss if any of it is a mistake you know what i'm saying and drake when drake get on your joint it sells you cannot deny that everything drake touch it turns to platinum ain't too many artists who who could do that in the last 14 years and meek mills need to sit his behind down and just get in the studio and make a new album and there's a lot of stuff going on with meek mills man but anyway, let me know what y'all think about that situation. You know what I'm saying? Next topic, let's go. Now, everybody is, you know, they 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 going in on Cardi B right now. You know, she got a song out right now. We should talk about the, the coach bags. I feel like females, they move up. When they get money, they get the cheap shit. When they start getting more money, they start buying expensive stuff. Me as a guy, I'm not spending no $10,000, $5,000, Twenty thousand dollars on no Gucci bags, no 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 Steve Michael bags, none of that shit. For real, I'm not even spending a thousand dollars on a, a bag. I'm no on nobody. Period. You take the bag I give you, and you don't want that bag, don't take nothing. Period. I feel like these dudes be spending all this money on on these females on bags, fifteen twenty thousand dollar bags that you could take that money and give to somebody who really need it, a family that really needs money you can help them out get them money to for a down payment on the house if you're going to spend twenty thousand on the bag somebody in the hood you should get that to somebody in the hood that's trying to move out the hood and get their own house you know what i'm saying a, a female who got two or three kids struggling she could take that twenty thousand get a down payment on the house and the, the money she's spending on rent she could use that and pay on her mortgage or something that she could own so i feel like a lot of dudes who be spending all this money on these females on these bags they dumb Here's what Cardi B was saying and trying to explain it to everybody who's that trying to clown her or her New Yorkers can't run everybody on the coach bags. Listen what Cardi had to say on this. Let's go. Um, I, yo, you know what? I be feeling like people from New York, like I feel like we live in our own little, our own little, um, our own little world, right? Because I'm getting dumb because everybody's like, bitch, what's wrong with coach? What's wrong with coach? All right, so let me tell you a funny story, right? 
like around in 2011 and shit i had some coach rain boots and i used to wear it all the fucking time i bought it in high school and everything and i used to wear my little coach rain boots all the fucking time then this nigga cameron come with this and fuck shit up let me let me let me coach Real dipset fan for real, for real, for real, for real, for all of them, all of them, all of them. So, um, so in 2011, everybody started getting rid of their coach shit, and like, because honest, honest truth, it was really because of camera. So, when I was doing this song, that's what I was thinking about. Like, it's like, bitch, do you want that or you want this? You want a Chanel, you want this bag, but it's like, now everybody jumping me. It's like, I'm not trying to be on some rich shit and everything. This is just a real New York shit. Like, I ain't trying to offend none of y'all. I'm getting tell me what y'all think about the Cardi situation, the interview, she did a little thing on YouTube, whatever. Tell me what y'all think. You think Cardi getting too Hollywood? She's not speaking her mind like she used to. You think Cardi B just doing too much? Because if you get money, you change. That's anybody. You know, so do you think Cardi B changing? Let me know. Next topic. Now, Kanye wife, her, her father is mad at Kanye for her dressing the way she dresses. I feel like you can't make no woman do something she don't want to do. I mean, some women, yeah, you could. But if she want to dress like that, she want to dress like that. I don't. I, I like a woman who just like to dress all kinds of ways and don't care what nobody say. You know, if she was with Kanye, would she dress like that? We don't know. But, I mean, this is the stuff that Kanye try to promote. These is clothes. A lot of females who like to wear this type of stuff. So, I mean, she ain't the only one who's wearing stuff like that. So, her, I don't know her and her dad is real close or not. But... We'll see. I don't know Kanye don't if he, he beef with the mom dad or not. I feel like the dad's trying to get a little clout because if that's your that's your son-in-law, you could just pick up the phone or go to the house or whatever and talk to Kanye about it and be like, "Yo, why you got my daughter looking like this? You got her looking like a you know prostitute if you want to say. You know what I'm saying? She is, but you know people do stuff for clout. You know, her, I'm not saying she's not close with her parents, but why would your dad put that out saying you don't want your daughter dressing like this and this and that i mean she's a grown woman she's married you know it is what it is kanye like it she like it it seemed like it she ain't complaining she ain't doing no interviews under that seemed like she a cool chick you know you know she got a lot of haters right now kanye ex wife kim she in her mid 40s she getting old she getting, she getting wrinkled she jealous of her and she just living her best life. I hope I hope the marriage lasts. You know what I'm saying? See what happens. But scratch to the channel, put a like and a button. We out. One love.